hi and welcome thank you for the person that request for this video well this video is all about teaching you guys how to trim a particular video or how to edit a video by trimming or cutting and i decided to do a 60 seconds video to teach you that but along the line i realized people might not understand the difference between trimming and cutting and splitting depending on different apps that we have now using this particular app i have the tutorial already on my video you can check that out this app helps you edit simple and short clip faster so it only has trim i'm telling you that this app has just trim it's just like telling you you can only trim from the beginning to the end that's what trim is all about you just scroll around the app now i'm listening to the to the words of this video afterwards i will I'll reduce the volume so the video is all about me telling people things i wish i knew about youtube before starting in my other channel kayaki moment so that's what it's all about now to because of the main topic we're trying to discuss trim on this s recorder they only have trim and trimming on this s recorder is more or less like going from front to the back like moving from the back to the front that's all what this trim is all about you can only move like if you want to cut the video maybe you made an error from the beginning and you want to trim it from the beginning and also you made an error at the back you also do it that way. but once you know you have made an error in the middle like this particular video you can't use trim definitely this app is not what you are meant to use instead try another app so in this tutorial i will be teaching you how to use another app to correct that so for this app particular app this s recorder you can only trim and trimming is more or less like moving from the back to the front you can't move or cut any object in the middle like this now example if i'm going to trim this particular video where i was already talking then at the middle i stopped to check some of my points to check some of the things i have already jot down to say so instead of me just talking and talking and talking that was why i was looking at my book down so because this is trim i can only move from back to the front i can't move to the middle because it will cut out the particular words i've said so far and those words are relevant to the video so i can't use trim to do that as you can see on the app we don't have any other thing except trim so this app only talks about or deals with trimming the video you can't do or cut or split but other apps also have that so in the next video you will be saying how to use another app to cut and split and that app is the best and simplest app so far because that's what i use in editing all my videos on my phone because it's way faster and easier but this S recorder i only use it to do short clips or instagram videos or certain videos that i know that the middle is always right and i don't have to cut it off or i don't have to cut it out it's always right but for my youtube videos where i know sometimes i look at my points sometimes i check for the next next thing to say i don't use this app to edit it instead i have my in shots app to do that that's why i have two different tutorial on my channel you have i have the in shot tutorial also and i also have the s recorder also each app have various things and function they are meant to do and what's their best good at as you can see trimming is just for the back to the front it can't move other than that so i can use the trim update at the middle so that was why i use the same video to teach you in the next app how to use trim and cut to edit your video so i'll be opening up my in shot app now I'm selecting that particular video so now i've picked that particular video you can see it also has trim now you know trimming is only to move from the back to the front if you know you have error about that you can use trim but when you know you want to cut something or object at the middle you use split or cut so that is what x recorder doesn't have but in short as also 
first of all i love to put my video in canvas so that the setting and the way it's showing the size will be bold and clear so now it's already there i will listen to the video i don't have to listen to the video from beginning to the end because i've done that in the first video so this time I, I will only be scrolling down to the particular point i want to split that is the place i stopped talking i actually wanted to talk about the first point and i started looking down so that's the particular place i will be scrolling down to so i can easily sorry for that the screen recorder is what i'm also using to screen record the video so that's why i'm saying that orange logo above now this is the exact point i was trying to check my book and to check for my point and as you can see it is not good to publish a video in that area or in that manner so i have to cut it out so now looking at the button of the screen you see different ways at which you can edit your video on this InShot app from the canvas where the size are, the sticker, the text, flitter and all. You see pre-cut. So trim, cut and split, those are the items that are named pre cut Now, on this split, when you click on pre cut you can also multi-split. So if I'm multi-splitting here, you see the video will be splitting into different segments depending on how i want to cut them like if i want to cut everything at once without going back to the clip itself then i can do that in that pre-cut using the multi splits but in this case i'm not doing that so i'll be undoing the video and now going back to the way i could actually do it so i'm moving faster now i'm at the particular video so i'll just be clicking on the split as you can see i'll watch the video then when i've gotten to when i've gotten to the point that is the right point that's where i will now split so now I'll click on split so you can see at this split at the editing body it makes it easier than using that pre-cut yeah you can easily just correct your mistake and get to the exact point in that other area you might do some mistake because you might not cut the video accurately so now i'll just move down to the end of that particular area and i'll trim it off then delete it as you can see i've done that so if you listen to this video from those points to the other point it will move smoothly that is where i said all right then the next point i'm saying now let's tell let me tell you my first point as you can see so that's why using the splits in this in short app is way easier when you know you want to edit different kind of places away from the video instead of using trim but if you use trim definitely you are only trimming something from the back to the beginning however i hope i'm able to deliver the point the basic point about trimming cutting and splitting in this video so tell me below your comment i would love to hear from you bye as always subscribe like and share